Welcome to Google Glass DIY. Um, we're going to teach you how to make Google Glass yourselves and you won't have to spend $1,500 plus a uh, tethering fee to do it. This was done with uh, some help from my friend Amanda, who's somewhat of an engineer by trade. Now, this project is pretty involved. You're going to need to have uh, basic materials understanding as, as well as rudimentary physics. I'm going to put some links below. Um, they should get you up to speed or at least help you move forward. Now, um, before we, we begin this project, I want to show you how it actually works and what materials you need. Um, first thing you need is um, you, you need some glasses, which, you know, if you're looking up Google Glass. You know. um, the other thing you're going to need is, is probably some, some duct tape and cardboard. Um, we found those to give the, that futuristic feel, uh, that silver that you really want in a gadget. And um, we also used a bow ding ball, which, you know, as a counterweight, you could use something else, but I, I, I would recommend it because it kind of puts you in a meditative state. So let me just show you how it works. So this is the device. Just go ahead and uh, get it initiated here. So as you can see, the bow ding ball is placed in a satchel, if you will. Now, um, this can work with most devices. We're, we're actually going to use a, um, an iPod 5 for this. So, here you go. Let me just... I'll, uh, I'll switch to head view in a minute. Okay, here we go. Siri, can you, can you turn on the camera, please? Siri? Sorry, I couldn't find turn on the camera, please, in your music. Hold on. Hold on. So um, here's how it basically works. Um, you just I'm gonna switch over to this right here, and uh, here we go. Easiest buy. You could just hands-free, you know, navigation, whatever, whatever you need, really. It's uh, it's pretty helpful. So thank you. I hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, have a great day.